Well, 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 here's Mama Bloom's brood. Today, we find Papa in his office at the Excello Pictures Corporation in Hollywood. As he is waiting, he's fidgeting. Listen. Hello? Hello? Are you there? Do you go to lunch again? I... Hello? Yeah, yeah, now listen. I want to know something. Ten minutes ago, Mr. Fink and Mr. Shiftbane said they were coming in to see me. Ten minutes ago, it was, and they ain't here yet. Find out if they went by way of the North Pole. Because if they did, I'm going to eat first. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Will I wait? Sure, I'll wait. Sure, I'll wait. Miss Lamille, ten minutes ago, those two dopes said they was coming here and I... Hello? Yeah? Yeah, yeah, but what? Oh, they're on their way. Well, what are they doing, crawling here? I've... Never mind, never mind, they got here at last, yeah, yeah. Hello, boys. Hello, Pa. Hi, Pa. Well, 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 sit down, boys, sit yep. down. Yeah, we've got some great news for you, Pa. How much? How much what? How much will it cost me to find that out? Oh, stop thinking about money, Pa. Yeah, yeah. If I stop thinking about it, then nobody in the family will be thinking about it at all. Well, 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 don't sit there. Tell me, what's the good news? Tell him, Harold. No, no, you tell him, Sid. Sidney, Harold, please, wait a minute. Good news you're having to tell me. All right. Why doesn't one of you tell me? If it was bad news, both of you would be breaking your necks to tell me first. But when it's good news, you can't open your mouth, huh? Besides, I don't believe there is any more good news. Okay, then, Pa, listen to this. The big picture's all finished. It's been shot, cut, edited... And it's ready for a preview. Tomorrow night, we're sneaking it into a theater in Pasadena. Is it so bad you got to sneak it in? Well, you don't get it, Paul. We're running a sneak preview on it. You know, just to get the reactions of the people who see it. And those reactions better be plenty good, or our name is Mud. Now, take it easy, Harold. He should take it easy. <laughs> I should take it on the run. Now, look, boys. I ain't bothered you even my little bit about the picture, have I? No, you've been swell. And we appreciate it, Paul. All right, all right, all right. So now, listen to me closely, because I'm asking a favor from both of you. Go ahead. What is it, Pa? Now, look, boy. Please. In a very soft voice. You shouldn't say it too loud. Tell me something. How much did the picture cost? No, 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 no. Has the cat got your tonsils? Well, Pa, it's, um, it's a big picture. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's coming. I feel it in my bones. <laughs> it's coming. No. So how much did the picture cost? $5,000. 10000 or maybe, no, I'm afraid to even think of that. But maybe it even cost twenty thousand dollars. <laughs> uh, well, uh, the costs aren't all in yet, Pa. But we'll have them for you, Sydney. Sydney, you're telling a fib. Huh? <laughs> that I can tell by your face. You know what the picture costs. Now listen, Pa. The, there are a lot of things you have to take into account. Yeah, 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 yeah. You see, this is a big picture. Uh huh. We have had to use a lot of extras. We took more time with the sequences. We had a few location shots that took time, and props and extras. We had costumes Something to get. Something is going to happen in a minute that I wouldn't want should happen even to my sons-in-laws. Boys, for the first and last time, I'm asking you again, how much did the picture cost? Go ahead, Harold. Tell him. Uh-uh. You're close to the door. You tell him. Somebody better tell me. Well, Pa, it's just as Harold says. You see, we had a lot of extra stuff in this picture that ran expenses up. And then then we 
borrowed an actor. Me borrowed an actor? Me borrowed an actor? <laughs> What's the matter? Sitting near you, Mashiga? You're crazy. We should be borrowing actors when we got actors around here on the country. Oh, we needed this one, Pa, to play opposite Mar Chevalier. Oh, you needed that one. You needed it, huh? Well, how much did you pay him? $3,000 a week. $3,000? Three th three th you... Oh, you Boys, for three thousand dollars a week, I would play opposite her myself. I'll be reasonable. Be reasonable. Huh? Sure, sure. Well, please tell me how much did the picture cost? Well, it cost give, about. Ma. Oh, hello, Ma. Gee, gee, we're glad to see you. Hello, boys. Excuse me, ten minutes ago you saw me outside. Now you're acting like you ain't seen me in a month of Saturdays. <laughs> Sundays. Yeah. To be a gentile, it's Sunday. To me, it's Saturdays. Uh, hello, Papa. Hello, Mama. Well, I. I guess we better be going, Harold. We've got a few things to check on. No, 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 Harold, Sidney. Not, not, not one foot are you putting out of this office until you're telling me what the picture costs. Is there a argument? There ain't no argument, Mom. I'm only trying to find out something, and these two schlemiels are trying to keep me from finding out. Boys, you should be ashamed from yourselves. Tell Papa what he wants to know. You shouldn't be keeping secrets from Papa. Mm, that's good, Mama. That's good. Uh, uh, Pa, we'll be back in a little while, and then we'll tell you. Come on, Harold. Sure, so long. So long, Pa. Hey, you, Sidney, you, you, uh... Hello, hey, Papa. Grace. I said hello before, Mama. Sit down, Papa, before you're choking to death. Oh. Now, Papa, tell me what's wrong again. Mama, mm -hmm. sometimes I think we should have stayed in New York in the knee pants business. Papa, ain't you having a good time out here? It's such a wonderful climate. Yeah, 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 but I can't pay my bills with climate. I can't walk up to the man who's making the customs for us and tell him to take his pay out in sunshine. Who said you should? Maybe Sidney and Harold did, Mama. They're afraid to tell me what the new picture costs. Yeah. They're beating around the bush because they don't want me to know. Ah, is the new picture finished? Was they keeping it for a surprise? <laughs> they could surprise me any time without the picture. Mama, Mama, tomorrow night they're, 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 they're sneaking it into Pasadena. Oh, sneaking it in. Smudgeless we got for son-in-law. No, 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 you don't understand, Mama. I don't. Do you? Uh, you of course. Uh, huh? No, no, Mama, I don't. Only Sidney and Harold could tell what Sidney and Harold are talking about. Didn't you ask them? Ten times I asked him what the picture cost. Then ten times they found something else to talk about. You should have put your foot up. Down, Mama, down. Up, down, you should have put it someplace. You're telling me. Papa, not that way. It would have been a pleasure. Papa, stop talking like a tough neck. Maybe you didn't ask the boys real nice. Uh-huh. Should I get down on my knees and beg them to tell me? I would like to know just once who is the president of this company. Look, who? Papa, look, it's like this. Yeah. Maybe the boys is afraid to tell you. Huh? Maybe they think that when they're telling you what it costs, you would be flying off the battle. Handle. So you should talk very nice to them when you're being mad even before they tell you. What do you think they would think you would think after you tell them? What? Mama, I'll bet you ten dollars you couldn't say that again. For ten dollars, I shouldn't try. But I know what I meant. <laughs> That's good, Mom. That's good. At least one person did. <laughs> Maybe you should sit here and ask the boys what the picture cost. I'll bet the hundred dollars, Mama, it cost at least twenty thousand dollars. Twenty thousand dollars? Oi, that ain't peanuts. Pe Mama, please don't talk like that. I can't help it. I hear everybody talking like that when I come here, so I'm trying to talk like that to understand other people. Mama, when we're alone, you should talk the way we've talked for twenty-five years. All right, Papa. All right. You shouldn't worry yourself about mind conversion, huh? You got enough to worry you right now. <laughs> You're telling me, mm. Papa. Why don't you call the boys back in here and pretend you ain't mad? Huh? We'll just talk a little bit, and then very easy, we'll bring the subject around to the band to the cost of the picture. <laughs> Mama, sometimes you got ideas, but they're very bad ones. Papa, I was just giving it to you for what I was worth. Huh? I am making a digestion, and right away your are uh, I don't even know whether I'm wanting to hear what the picture cost. If it costs $20,000, I'll stay awake one night for each dollar. And if I'm staying awake for 20,000 nights... Then you could write a I... book like the lady in the stories. What are you talking about? Huh? Her name was Cherizade, and she had a husband who was an insult. He wanted to cut off her head, but she kept talking, so he couldn't cut off her head while her mouth was open. <laughs> then he was a schlemiel. That was the time to do it. Papa, you're getting away from the subject. To get away from the subject is spending $20,000. I'd talk about anything else. Papa, remember the old adverb. Never put off tomorrow what you're going to do the next day. Mama, I, I don't know why I'm doing this, but to please you, I'll call the boys back in here and pretend I'm not mad. That's good, Papa, that's good. And, uh... Per I'll huh? loosen your collar so that when you do get mad, your face won't get so red, yeah? <laughs> I'll get undressed if it'll save me money. Call the boys, Papa. All right, all right. If I can only find the right button, I'll call the boys. <laughs> this morning I pressed the button got somebody I didn't even know worked here. Well, what was he doing here? <laughs> as soon as I can find out who he was, I, I will ask him. Let me see. The, this button, this one. There, there, there. No. Again. There. <coughs> here it is. <laughs> uh, Mr. Shipbay and Mr. Fink. <laughs> Mama, I'll bet $10 they're going to lunch. Hello! 
Uh, tell Mr. Shiftbane and Mr. Fink that I want they should come to my office right away. I... Who am I? Don't play ask me again, I'm a big quiet. I am Mr. Bloom. Yeah. Oh, 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 now you know. All right, now that you know, tell them to come here right away. And tell them I want them quick. You see, Papa, it's all very simple. Now, if you will let me do the turkey... And who could stop you? Don't make wisecracks, Jake. Oh, if the picture costs one penny over $20,000, I'm going to die. You won't die, Jake. That's very dangerous to your health. That's very... That... <laughs> Oh, hey, look at Mama. Isn't there a good reason that I'm so aggravated? Look, Mama, right around the corner, they have to come to get here. Just around the corner, a little way. And it takes them all this time to get... Uh, <laughs> you wanted to see us, Pa? Yeah, yeah, we're pretty busy, Pa. Hello, hello, boys, hello. Come, hello. come on in. Uh, sit down, sit down, boys, sit down. Smoke a cigar. Uh, no, 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 not those, not those. Uh, the good ones over here. Yeah. <laughs> well, uh... Uh, what do you want, Pa? Uh, Sidney, uh, Papa and me were sucking. And you know that Papa likes to get his bills paid. Now, uh, you should be telling him what the picture costs, yes? The new picture? Sidney, Papa? I... Papa? <laughs> I'll close my mouth. Well, we, we haven't quite got it itemized yet. It, uh... You, um, you don't know what it costs, but you're going to sneak it away? Oh, that means we're going to preview it tomorrow night, Ma. So you should know what it costs. <laughs> Uh, maybe $5,000. Oh, gee, Ma, give us a break. $5,000 is pin money for a picture like this one. Well, for $5,000, you could be buying pins for diamonds in them. Uh, Ma, you you got to realize that we did a big thing there. I could think of something to say to that, but I'm supposed to be keeping quiet. Yeah, Jack, and you ain't doing it. I am? Sidney. Huh? And Harold. Huh? Don't be bashful. How much did the picture cost? Uh, maybe 10000 huh? We, uh, we had a lot of extras. Uh, location shots. Good actors and actresses. And costumes and props. Talking. They can. Be quiet, Papa. All right. Well, Ma, Pa, we, uh, it's Harold and I, we know that the picture's going to be a big success, so we wouldn't have spent all the money on it. It's coming. Harold and Sidney, how much, huh? Look, Papa ain't mad at all. No, no. See, he's a businessman, and he's doing it to make money. You got to spend it. But not too much. Papa, one more void from you, and I'm going home. All right, go ahead and ask him. Sidney and Harold, I'm waiting. Well, the, the cost of the picture won't, won't run over... $250,000. <laughs> there you see, Papa. They've got... That well. <laughs> Oi! Baby, I didn't hear it right. How much? $250,000. Now we got to go to lunch. I... Uh, Papa, don't say anything. We'll see you later, Ma. I... Uh, Oi, $250,000. I... Papa, I'm proud of you. You never said a word. I... Papa. Papa. Oi! No wonder he didn't say a word. He's unconscious. Oh! <laughs> 